Here we go, viewers. We're nearly there. You've held faith with us for right. five episodes. <laughs> this marathon removing of the dashboard. <laughs> She's coming out. Alright, custom dash time. Look how much room there is. Yeah, wow. wow. <laughs> Mate, that is... Well, I think we've taken something out of there. There should be some gizzards in that. <laughs> <laughs> there you go, Zach. I found your innards. There you go. I knew they'd been there somewhere. That's still supposed to be in that little black box. So Yeah, uh, obviously we were supposed to unplug that. But yeah. Didn't happen. Pure force and determination got in the way. It looks like actually with it in this position that it's not as complex as it felt like coming out. It's not actually. Like. Now looking at it, what have we got? One, two bolts, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, what, 10, 11, 12 bolts. The rest of it is one, two, three, four, Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, twenty-one, twenty-two, twenty-three, twenty-four, twenty-four clips. Well, yeah, wiring tw clips. Twenty twenty-four plugs, yeah. <laughs> so twelve <laughs> bolts and twenty-four plugs. Twenty-four plugs. <laughs> just to pull the dashboard out. <laughs> yeah. Not to mention what we also had to take out of the center console either. Yes, that's not including the center console. Not including the center console. Not including all this computer stuff. Yep, and the vents and the in the um, phone, mate. Yeah, the, yeah, everything, the whole bit. Look at it. It's Although, like I said, give Lexus credit for a car that's how old. Yeah. Like I said, it's uh, probably over-engineered to the point where, like we said, we knew it was probably never going to rattle. If it's going to rattle, it's going to rattle now. Well, they don't they don't build them to make them easy to pull apart, or at least they didn't. I think a lot of manufacturers now have gone to this concept of making cars simpler and this is what we keep harping on about how complex this is yeah. you get cars that now are simpler because it makes them quicker to build yeah. therefore less expensive to build as opposed to this which is like a experiment in how do we make this as good as possible yeah. like no holes barred I think I watched a documentary on LS400 development once and it was talking about um, how they they had limited imports into the US so rather than bringing in mass produced cheap cars they decided they bring in the most expensive lower volume versions that they could make the highest margin on and that that this car that sits right here it? is that car you see quite often body parts like that in cars that just don't have any sort of protection on them. So you can see I've been talking about how cracked this dash is. It's got this enormous <coughs> split in it. And then that split, yeah, there you go. Straws galore. I don't think we've seen the end of the straws yet. No, I think we'll find some more. Um, but yeah, that is it. That is that done. Let me side of the back out. Which is pretty much this phase of build part done. We've got to now pull out the sister dash to this from the parts car dashboard seats door trims we've got all these parts coming from this other car we've got a leather care pack which has come from a sydney company called divine leather care that we're going to do like a rejuvenation of those seats before they go into this car yep. because they are not as cardboard like as these ones yeah these ones are just yeah, the cardboard is probably the best description. Yeah, but they are still a little bit firm, like they're going that same way. Yeah. So um, I'm hoping that we can bring a bit of life back into them before they go in here. So Soften they're, them up. Hope, uh, you know, the hope is that they don't just split apart like these ones have. We thought about doing some sound deadening and whatnot, but I'm not sure if we're going to bother because this car is super quiet anyway. It's ridiculous. Plus, I really don't want to pull more of it apart. No. <laughs> Although, once the front seats come out, we're basically there anyway, so... Um, yeah. I honestly don't think it's going to need it. I don't think it's worth yeah. it. I but. personally feel like that's just to save that money put it elsewhere. Yeah, we'll definitely put that into something else yeah. for sure. I have to agree with you there. Um, my next phase is still working on bumper bars and guards. Yeah. The painting, that's yep. where I'm up to. Yeah. Um, yes, there's still a lot more to come off before it all starts going back together. 
Yeah, and I think we'll probably start looking at maybe trying to tackle some of the actual hardcore body work shortly yeah, too. Well. Yeah. Um, especially with you having a few Wednesdays free and that sort of thing, because if, if it looks like I've got jobs on that are not necessarily suitable for two people, even if you've still got the time, you can just come here and start sanding the body or... So I'm using my holidays. Yeah, whatever. So I still get paid. Whatever. So, sounds like a plan. All yeah. right, guys. That's on, it. On that note. That is it. Have fun. See you next time. <laughs>